Hi everybody and welcome to Josiah is Right. So recently I shared some Graphation Film Festival videos. So some stuff we did with the Kyotos at the Hive Gallery. So thank you to all of them who were involved, including the Kyotos, the Hive, Nathan, all the people that would come to these events. Uh, Andrew, of course, my partner in Graphation and my dear friend. So thank all of you guys for making all that stuff happen. I want to share another one and Sam Hale who connected me with Kyotos and connected me with a person I'm going to talk about right now. And that person is Kevin McTurk. So Kevin, I mentioned in my Jim Henson video, um, and I mentioned actually in the Comic-Con video because we ran into each other uh, on the street, which was pretty cool. So Kevin is just funded on Kickstarter a film called The Haunted Swordsman, I think. The name escapes me, I didn't write it down. Um, so I'm pretty sure it's The Haunted Swordsman, but he just funded that, which is awesome. It'll be a really cool film. He does these really amazing puppet films. So, so I'm gonna share from his last one, The Mill at Calder's End. So it was really cool. He brought the puppets to an event we did at the Hive when he was actually funding that one on Kickstarter a few years back and showed us how the puppets work, the intention with the story, all these really cool things. So be sure to check out this footage. It's again, it's another Hive event. So I just filmed it on my phone without any kind of plan. There's actually a microphone that you'll see at times. That microphone is not recording audio for me. It was recording for a podcast. Um, for a thing called Film Snobbery. So hopefully I can find that. I've actually never heard it myself. Um, so hopefully we can add that to this in the links. And if I find it, I'll put it down there. So, um, the is, and he said, I can make some flywheels. Oh. And this way, the hand is barely attached. It's just, there's a little plastic, uh, little plastic band in there. <laughs> and then also in the back, so, what I wanted to avoid was, the, on Victor Carlock I had a lot of rods that came out right out of the back of the head, and I had to do a lot of rod removal later on. So um, I wanted to try to control more inside, and uh, so he's really wobbly, but uh, basically there's right and left, and then there's a trigger that goes up and down. And then I can show you, actually, of course. What they look like, and this is his scared expression. Here's like standard, and then there's a little more of a frightened look. And so the second half of the film, he's kind of in this panic. The Charleston, or do the Charleston? <laughs> you can do. I'm still trying to work out him scrambling away from clues. Add some shots with that. So, so the love was. He's kicking. He's kind of fending himself off. So again, I talked to another mechanic. Uh, named Luke Conlan, who I work with. And uh, I said, remember those toys that are at the Fighting Nun? <laughs> so I was like, I need a pair of Fighting Nun legs. So you kind of just... <laughs> 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 uh, and he's going to be kicking off this giant creature. <laughs> 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 so, uh, sort of the handle, but this one snaps, and then this dirt neck snaps onto another copy of this head that the uh, super formula is, just for one shot. Floating around. She doesn't have a hand yet, but um, she has the same mechanism inside that's the trigger. Not quite hooked up. But, uh, and then I have a beautiful version of her, and then the fabric is going to kind of obscure her, and then she's going to be this hideous version. So. And that's kind of where I... So thank you very much for watching. Be sure to check out all of Kevin's Spirit Cabinet films. They're really good. The upcoming Haunted Swordsman. And be sure to like, subscribe, and comment. Thank you guys so much. And again, appreciation to all the people who helped me in Graphation. Andrew, Nathan, Sam, Kevin. A lot of great people. Thank you so much.